Well, in this video, we are going to look at how to use a Microsoft Word document without using a mouse. I know very many people have been asking themselves, how do you use this document in case my mouse goes faulty? What am I supposed to do? Well, in this video, we are going to look at that in particular. Now, before you forget, please subscribe, subscribe, like the video, share it, and don't forget to subscribe so that you don't miss any video coming ahead in this channel now as earlier on complicated we are going to look at how to use microsoft word without a mouse and here we go so we have uh situations where a mouse goes faulty and you're rushing you get fixing your mouse you get going to the shop you want to buy a mouse now here how do we use it without a mouse now this is what is technical now we are going technical so you got to sit down and look at this so here we have our document we have our text that is going to be edited now here we will start uh, with the functional key six we have functional keys one two three four five six seven eight up to twelve ten to up to twelve so we are going to start with uh in this particular tutorial we'll be working on functional key six yes now with this functional key six well, it's going to help us navigate through the word processor it's going to help us process what we have in this word document uh-huh now once you press the uh f6 function that is functional key six press f6 uh, button on your keyboard aha uh -huh. you see what it does it gives us a couple of letters here we have uh, h n g p s m r w q y but what we do with these letters once you want to select a particular tab we have the file tab home tab insert tab design tab layout references mailing pre review and review now what, what do we do with this all now once you want to activate the specific tab for example the formatting tool that we want is in microsoft uh, i mean is in the home tab what we do here is go to your keyboard press the h button after you press the h button what comes next is what do you want what do you want in particular the computer is asking you the word processor is asking what do you want so what whatever you see all here whatever you see that looks like letters are letters and numbers themselves so if you want to activate or rather to use any formatting tool right here you got to press the combination of letters in that formatting tool for example if i want to use a, a bold i have to press number one and when i press it goes practical Saha. so another way is press the f6 button now what happens we have we are done with the issue of the activation of the home rather the the menu menu tab so let's come to the text as you press the f6 button it activates the tab the tabs first then comes to formatting tools in case you select the specific tab that you want then the next pressing of your functional six button will come to the document so here we have our cursor let's go practical the first one there we are second one our cursor is blinking without me using the mouse i'm just pointing at it without me using the mouse another another okay so there we go so how do we highlight we want to select let's direct our blinking cursor i want it to be go up there we are so highlight your first paragraph 
Oh, sorry. I release the shift button. Press your shift button down. Arrow down. There we are. So we got our first paragraph highlighted. Uh, F6 button. We have a wonderful formatting tool. Good. Home tab. Good. What do you do first here? Let's change the font type which is ff ff there we are press enter hmm f sorry undo let's go back to our home tab f f we got to type which specific uh Font style we want. Let's say ta home, ta home. It's right there. Press enter. There we are. We got the the font style activated. Let's go back to our formatting tools again. H. We want to bold. Press one. Mm, there we are. We got our work bold. Formatting tools again. H. Oh, we want to center a line that is AC. I hope you're seeing center alignment. Center AC, press A and C. There we are. We have the work aligned at the center. So that is how we use Microsoft Word without a mouse. What else do we want to see here? Uh, let's come and blink us down. I hope you see the blinking cursor moving to the second paragraph at the start. Shift, highlight your work. We want to design what we do here now. Uh, let's increase the font size. F6 functional 6 button. Press. Mm, we want the home tab still. Let's look at. Uh, let's look at increase font. That is F G, F G. Good. Another. Let's do it again. F six button. H. F G. We see our. Paragraph 2 is increasing. We we'll do it again. H F G. There we are. That's enough. Can we underline it? Uh, our F6 button again. Home tab. What we do here? Uh, there's underline that is number 3. I hope you're seeing number 3. I want the dotted lines. That is all we want. Enter. There we are. Good. This amazing uh, cursor down in paragraph three. Okay. Now let's control A. We want to highlight everything. No, no, no. We don't want to highlight what is up. We don't want what is up. We don't want okay. Could we go? Oh no, undo scroll down. We only want our paragraphs here. We are uh, sorry for that interruption. So, here we want to bullet our work. Here we go. F6 mm -hmm. from tab want to bullet our work which is N oh no I went to a wrong place can we go back F6 H we have letter 
n there we go select numbers enter our work is there with numbers so that is how we use microsoft word without a mouse and there i hope you understand please don't forget to subscribe to this channel so that you don't miss any coming ahead technological advice from this channel thank you and we wish you the very best i have to close